Hello YouTube, Dave here again. So earlier in the day I was out with the missus. Uh, we just sort of went and walked around the mall a little bit just to try to get out of the apartment that we don't get out of very often these days. And uh, we stopped into EB Games and just looking around uh, there. I've honestly been trying to find a set or a copy of the Dritzt and Guinevere uh, Funko Pops, like the two-pack, <clears throat> because it's supposed to be a GameStop exclusive, and EB Games is owned by GameStop, and it's just what they call them uh, here in at least Nova Scotia, but I know a lot of places in Canada go by uh, EB Games instead of GameStop. Anyway, <clears throat> looking through there, and the missus spotted something that um, she seemed <laughs> most insistent on, uh, on me getting, or, or, or her getting for me, to be more accurate. And this is the D&D Dungeons & Dragons official D12 shaped mug. So I just thought I'd do a quick video on it, and uh, just kind of show you guys, because uh, this very well could become my new uh, morning coffee mug. So, uh, let's just go ahead and take a look at the packaging here. So you can just sort of see, it's like a metal, uh, metal cup, or metal uh, mug. And it says it includes a D20 sticker. So that's kind of cool. And just on the back, you get a picture of it there. Uh, so it's not suitable for dishwasher or microwave. We don't have a dishwasher, and I wouldn't microwave this anyway. Uh, clean before first use. That is definitely going to go be without saying, because <clears throat> this thing has been on the store shelf for, well, I don't know how long, but it definitely needs to be washed before I do anything with it. But anyway, let's uh, just go ahead and pop it open here. All right, so here are the contents of the box. Uh, I did just quickly wash this out. Um, I just I did it quickly, so it looks like I missed a couple spots inside, but I will be washing this more thoroughly when I go to do the actual, or when I go to actually use it. Um, I just wanted to make it look a little bit better because there were a lot, there was like a lot of dust and stuff that had uh, built up in there. Probably been on the shelf for a little while because I, th I think I've seen them there for at least a couple months. Um, or it's been sitting in a warehouse for a while and just accumulated stuff. But regardless, uh, this is a really cool little mug. You know, it's got the, the D12, which is a horribly underutilized, underappreciated die in uh, Dungeons & Dragons, unless you're a barbarian with a great axe. But uh, yeah, it's neat. I like it. Um, I think it'll make for a decent, uh, yeah, just a decent drinking mug in the morning uh, with tea or coffee. Uh, there's actually, it, there's more room inside than there might look to be. Um, so yeah, I think it'll do really well. I'm actually going to be kind of curious to see how it holds up against my regular uh, coffee mug that I've been using for the last couple of years now, actually. Um, but yeah, this is really, really cool. It's got the D20 brand, or the Dungeons & Dragons branding on it, the ampersand logo, and it does come with the D20 sticker. Uh, which I don't use stickers, but I will put this in like a box set or something just to just to keep it um, and uh, just have it as a little odd collectible thing uh, in my collection. But this is a really cool mug, and uh, I, I'm very thankful uh, for my wife picking this up for me and uh, basically insisting that I should do a video on it. And, you know, she was right. Uh, this is just a fun, quick little video um, to just sort of show this off. And uh, just make people aware that this is a thing that exists, if you're interested in uh, picking it up. Like I said, I got it at EB Games, which is the, uh, uh, again, I think it's just the Canadian, or at least here in Nova Scotia, it's just uh, a subsidiary of GameStop. Um, it's just, they, they own EB Games. They used to be different companies, but they're not anymore. So, yeah, it's just, again, really, really cool stuff. And they had just a regular um, ceramic mug as well. Uh, this is ceramic. Um, it just has like the metal sort of coating on it there, uh, but it is a ceramic mug. Um, but they had just a regular shaped mug in there as well with the ampersand logo on it. And I was looking at that one, uh, but she insisted on getting me this one. And uh, I think it's pretty cool. So I'm looking forward to uh, to actually uh, making a cup of tea in you know, a few minutes after I finish recording this. So uh, there you go. So if any of you have picked this up, let me know what your thoughts on it are, if you've been using it uh, regularly or if it's more of a uh, display piece for you. Um, you know, there's nothing wrong with that either. So thanks again for you, everyone taking the time out of the day to watch this video. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Take care.